No, I don't think there is enough in representation by the women in this industry so far. In fact, look at the awards today, right? There are only five female leaders into analytics industry who are getting this award out of 100 people, right? It's a very bad number to look at, right? So I think a lot of organizations across the world are doing a lot to bring women to work. They are giving a lot of perks like uh, longer uh, maternity leaves, equal pay, uh, flexible working hours for women. And organizations like uh, Analytics India, uh, they are also doing a lot in the area to bring in more women, right? So like the uh, events like Rising, Women in AI, and across globe as well, a lot of things are happening for women. So things are happening, representation is still less. So I think we just need to keep pushing and pushing and make sure that we get more and more representation whenever such kind of events are happening. So I would say you guys should aim to get, if not 50%, maybe 20 to 30% uh, awardees as female by the year 2025. So that should be the aim. I think that will that will be brilliant to do. That will be a brilliant KPI to measure the representation of female leaders in an event like this and in the analytics industry so, uh, overall. I think uh, my passion for analytics started from my school days. Analytics to me is all about manipulating and playing with the data. And in order to do that, you need to be really good in mathematics. And I loved mathematics since my childhood. It was it used to my favorite sub it used to be my favorite subject. And I have seen that over time, as I have been part of the industry, uh, that passion has just grown and grown and grown. I don't know something happens to me when I get a data set and I just try to just scan it and look at various aspects of it. I I try to do what more I can do uh, with that data. I mean, uh, playing with the data is something I'm passionate about and analytics industry is giving me that opportunity. So that's brilliant. See, I, I, I attended an event, a NASCOM event last year, uh, which was focused around AI, etc. Uh, but uh, the kind of experience I, I have got here uh, at uh, MachineCon is just brilliant. I have attended so many presentations here and uh, almost all the talks which were done around uh, data science and uh, analytics I'm actually taking back a lot of ideas to my job and I'm going to try and implement so for example there was a presentation on how to better use the weather data to improve uh, your analytics decisions right so I, I work in the commercial banking space and I deal with the uh, small and medium enterprises and part of my portfolio includes customers who are from the agriculture sector I'm actually thinking how I can use the weather data to come up with insights for those agriculture customers to actively provide them solutions which can help them do better in their business so I think the presentations and the speakers Brilliant. And I hope I see at least one female speaker next year when I'm back at MachineCon. <laughs>